I would like to bring in Blue Feel. Hugh is going to be representing Blue Feel. Tell us a little bit about what Blue Feel is and any relation they have to the European markets and what they're looking for. So Hugh, welcome aboard. Thank you. Uh, I'm going to share my screen and introduce my company because pages are prepared. Uh, uh, can you guys see this? Oh, okay. Uh, actually, I wish... <laughs> Uh, I wish I had fast presentation pages like other attendees here. I'm sorry, but for some reason, uh, the file I prepared doesn't work on my laptop now. So I will be introducing my companies through these pages. Mm. We are Bluefield and uh, we are an appliance startup, uh, startup specializing in small home of electronics. We began our journey in 2017 when we spun up from Samsung Electronics. Uh, before spinning up, we used to be Samsung Electronics uh, R&D engineers. And as an in-house venture team of Samsung, we were recognized for our product design and technology. Uh, as we spun up, we successfully attracted their investment, I mean, from Samsung in 2018. Since our beginning, we have introduced two to three new products each year. And this year, we, we received the CES Innovation Award and IF Design Award for our air quality monitor and humidifier. So um, our main mission is to provide solutions to inconveniences people have unconsciously become used to when using uh, home up, uh, home appliance products. Uh, we often witness inconveniences caused by products that are uh, often taken for granted because people just think it is the way it is. The inconveniences may come from a product careless user interface or the product itself. We uh, we research and develop our products based on user experience data to solve these unquestioned on questioning companies from design to manufacturing processes, uh, the first priority we, uh, our engineers and our designers is to find and solve bad user experiences existing among similar products. Uh, we've been growing year by year in the small appliance industry in Korea and hope people all over the world can meet us soon. And these, uh, these are our products. Uh, we started. We started uh, our fan technologies. Uh, so we actually two thousand seventeen and eighteen we introduced more than four fan products. Here they are, and what's special about our products? Uh, is uh, in terms of technology, we have an um, advanced motor technology. Our first product was Mini Head Fan Pro uh, that is on the screen. Uh, it is the handheld fan with ultra lightweight and long battery life. Uh, the size is also super compact. All of these were uh, possible because we applied a drone motor technology to this fan to minimize, uh, maximize wind speed and battery life and to minimize weight and size. Uh, we made and tuned the motor with our technology and after this fan, the first product we made, we applied this technology to other fan products uh, on the screen. Uh, we made from table fan, neck fan to camping fan. So, uh, when it comes to our design, our mission, as our mission shows, our uh, our main focus is to solve inconveniences most people, uh, most people, and most products in the market often ignore. As hardware products are uh, easily judged by their external design, our design team's main focus is to solve main 
so um, inconveniences caused by design factors among hardware products. Mm. And the, uh, and the reason why we decided to make small appliances is because uh, as our living spaces in Asia are getting smaller and smaller and one person household is becoming irresistible, uh, irresistible demographic trend, we realize that people need small appliances for only one person, not big appliances. Uh, today, this trend is not only found in Asia, but also in Europe and even in the United States. Therefore, uh, we saw some opportunities and found our motivation to create something useful for one person household. Um, and uh, they, uh, actually, we been, uh, still, we've been ra uh, raising more than 5 million US dollars on global crowdfunding platforms. And even today, we uh, we have launched a new crowdfunding campaign on Kickstarter. So um, please see, uh, please uh, have, take a look at the products on, online. And if, and if there's any anything, you find inter oh, interesting and useful for you, please buy and try. Uh, our technology and design will provide some uh, unexperienced solution. Uh, yeah, I think this is pretty much all I can say for the presentation. Thank you so much. Um, some mm -hmm. really cool products in there. Um, <laughs> yeah, so, uh, I, I'm going to ask you about a few of them, actually. Oh, you stopped on the one I was interested in right there. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Uh, being at, that I live uh, as a single, what do you call it, a single person dwelling myself, mm -hmm. um, I found it pretty interesting to kind of see your approach in innovation, uh, but mm -hmm. also seeing products that I could benefit from. Uh, is that a chart? Is that a charging station that's part of that vacuum? Ah, uh, yeah. Uh oh. Well, this vacuum has a wireless charging station that is in, uh, that is included in the package. And the reason why we made this vacuum is uh, because of the uh, living spaces getting smaller and smaller. And it's uh, actually, it raised five million, uh, not five, this one is two million US dollars on Kickstarter wow. and Indiegogo. And now it's one of our best selling items in the United States and in Japan as well. Uh, what's special about this product is we tune the motor. So the the weight is just five or uh, 500 grams, but the suction power is more than 17 pascals. Uh, pascals wow. suction powers. Yeah, it's, uh, actually the product is right next to me. I brought here, uh, if <laughs> it is okay, I can show you <laughs> right now. Sure. Uh, uh, okay, then I will. Stop the share of the screen and uh, like this. This is wireless charging station, and this is the vacuum cleaner. Oh, can you see this? Yes. <laughs> yeah. Uh, let me show you the power first. It's seventeen thousand pascal suction power. Did you guys see that, that it doesn't it... <laughs> It's absorbing my hand. Oh, it's... and after using it, you can just drop on the onto the charging station for easy charge. Oh, uh, the the reason why we made this is uh, as our living spaces are getting smaller and smaller, people have no space to hide their or uh, their cleaning tools behind their closets. So our intention is to help uh, help people put this vacuum right next to their desk or bed. And if there is something or uh, some mess in their site and just clean that. And after using, after using it, just drop in on the charging station. That is, that is our intention. <laughs> okay, uh, that's pretty cool. Um, 
Uh, I'm going to ask you. I'm going to stop right now because I'm going to ask you a few more questions later. Mm -hmm. uh, Clement, um, if there's anything you'd like to bring up, uh, the floor is yours. Thank you. Um, I think um, I can see that um, working pretty well in Asia, where uh, people don't really have their own um, houses like in US or or Europe. Mm -hmm. um, I can also see, uh, I can also uh, see that for people having apartments uh, in Europe. Um, but how do you compete with, um, for example, Xiaomi in China uh, mm. and Miniso, um, all these kind of uh, companies who are also doing um, small fans, small uh, products like this? Mm. Uh... Actually, because we are a small startup, uh, to com uh, competing with competing with big companies like Xiaomi, um, Dyson, or mm -hmm. you know, some other competitor, uh, big competitors, is really difficult. But uh, what I can say uh, confidently is the our motto is really powerful compared. Uh, actually, in the same class, it is the top uh, top suction power. Uh, even Dyson doesn't can, uh, actually they don't have small vacuums, but if their size is, uh, mm -hmm. if their size were smaller or uh, small like us, then uh, our suction power will definitely uh, beat them. As uh, Also our uh, our choice, or uh, actually our, our selection of materials uh, for each product is really, uh, really, really strict. Or uh, to minimize or uh, to minimize and lower the weight and to maximize user uh, experience with uh, through my uh, buttons and other touch uh, touch feeling. So, uh, I think that is uh, that is our biggest uh, the biggest selling points and also to compete with uh, big competitors we actually we are really working hard to build some build strong strategies for online marketplaces such as amazon and other or uh, other big marketplaces in europe uh, so i think we will experience three years and errors but we oh eventually we are going to make it after after some time so what's the current price, for example, for this uh, vacuum cleaner? Uh, this vacuum cleaner, this vacuum cleaner, uh, the end customer price is 170. Actually, it is really okay. high compared to other small vacuums. Uh, but the reason, the reason the price is high is because we design and we select all the materials and we make the motor ourselves. Uh, that is the reason why the price is kind of high and and also the current economic situation the strong us dollar mm -hmm. yeah that's why yeah okay mm -hmm. thank you thank you for asking uh, so i have another question mm -hmm. how many of these products do you have in your home right now how many of your uh, products four actually i have this vacuum and also also this fan this this camping fan and and mini head fan pro also we have humidifier here i use this in my car hmm. i like the um the fan was also a kind of a really cool one the little mini fan just because it was smart i mean i like especially as a guy i don't mm -hmm. have a purse to carry my a fan in um so the less i can carry around the, the better so i thought that was uh, a really smart smart idea uh yeah oh actually most uh, most handheld fans are uh, last less than uh, two, uh 15 hours but ours last up to 24 hours it is a truly uh it's a true uh cordless and portable handheld fan you can use Great. Um, well, um, I I don't think I have any more questions. I may have to go on your website to see what else you're selling. 
Mm-hmm. Um, but that being said, I appreciate also your uh, enthusiasm, your conviction, and your belief in your own products. And I think that really comes off well. So um, I can uh, see that you're a good salesperson as well. Thank you for saying that. <laughs> mm-hmm. uh, so uh, is there anything else anyone else wants to chime in? Or is there anything else you'd like to say before we go? Um, uh, web, do you have a website? Is it just bluefield.com or where do we find uh, you? Oh, I'm gonna Bluefield. Oh, you can you can just type on the searching bar Google uh, Bluefield, then you can find this. Great, thank you so much. I always like talking to someone who uh, has a consumer product that I can immediately use. So appreciate it. Thank you.